Hi family, this is Kedra. Um, glad to be back to continue our conversation about the dark triad. Um, the next question goes to, can you be too empathetic? Well, you definitely can be, um, like for me, you know, I think in, in for anyone else who, who uh, registers as an empath or sees themselves or has been told by a therapist that they're an empath, which if you're if you find that you've had more than one relationship with someone from the dark triad, you probably are an empath because that like that's what they're seeking. Um, I was looking at uh, the I forget I don't know the name of the show, but it's on Netflix. It just came out. It's a fictional portrayal of the Ted Bundy story, and it, it and it tells it from the point of view of the you I mean you get it from him but it's almost narrated and you're also seeing the side of the woman that he was uh in love with quote unquote or in this relationship with um and so what i what i thought was real interesting though as they share that and even in the real story so the ted bundy tapes where you're hearing it in his own words um a lot of stuff you will hear how how he used empathy even though he's not going to ever use that word but that's how he that's how he got his victims so um he might have an arm cast on and then be struggling to open a door you've seen that in i think there there was a movie it might have been um uh, Silence of the Lambs where the guy had the cast on and he's trying to load a box in the back of a van and it's dropping and everything and so someone who's empathetic um and empathetic and not having had been burned before so because if you're empathetic and you've been burned before then when that thing kicks off that makes you want to jump in and help and be the rescuer you're going to hold that back because the last time that happened you got burned it's kind of like touching a hot stove so even though your impulse is to help you still might not help and i find myself doing that and you know and i feel really bad about that sometimes because i think there are people who possibly really need help but because of situations that have happened to me in the past I don't feel free um, to be able to help them so um, so you know we all kind of lose out there but can you be too empathetic yes because what you do is when you're too empathetic and then your boundaries are not good then what happens is you help someone beyond um, beyond what is beneficial to you um, and so what ends up you know you end up giving too much or being there too much and and ultimately you know getting used or exploited by someone and even though um, I have to be honest for myself when I've been exploited um, or from someone else's maybe the therapist perspective been been exploited I didn't necessarily feel like I was exploited which is a very interesting concept and so I'm gonna I'll probably do another video on that probably a little bit later today because that's a, a real interesting concept that has to do with victims of the dark triad because we feel genuine love and we feel genuine connection and we really do want to help so when we look when we help and we do those things that we feel that we're being called to do for me personally I don't regret it I don't regret doing anything it's just once I see what it is then I just move on so I don't regret I don't have a negative or bitter or any of that and um, and so yeah I think you can I think there is such a thing of being uh, so empathetic that you are not self-protective and that's where uh, the problem comes in so with that I'm gonna end this video I thank you guys for tuning into this series I hope it's helpful Please, if you've not subscribed, subscribe, hit the red button, and then tap the bell so that you can be notified when I upload new videos. Also, if there's something that you want me to tap on or you have feedback on any of these videos, please feel free to make some comments below. You can also find me at Kedra Flowers on Facebook or Messenger. So if you want to message me, which some people have figured out, message me privately. Please feel free to do that. because. You know, so with that, you have a great day and stay tuned. There's more videos to come.